going to have a couple of storms. Actually, I think three storms in the next two weeks. So if she's in heat, it's not gonna make a difference. drama listen to a theme she's like super quiet but I suspect she's in heat she's been flagging all day but it's raining and she's hating being outside with Dom so I'm gonna try to put them in the feed room come on come on come on girl come on girl You can go in. Let's see if I can find Dom. Dom! I know. She is kind of stressed out looking for Clara. But she is not allowed though. She she actually is very timid. So uh, I think that all this crying is mostly for Clara and not so much because she's in heat. Um, I've heard her uh, cry a couple times and she's been wagging her tail. Now she's stressed out. But let me give her... Come here, girl. Come here. Let's eat. Right here. You can come and eat. I know. Come here. You're just as clueless as your dad. Come here, Athene. I know, sweet girl. Let me see if I can find them and put them in here so they're not wet out there. It's really hard to see what's happening over here. But we're going to have a couple of storms. Actually, I think three storms in the next two weeks. So if she's in heat, it's not gonna make a difference if it's today or tomorrow. Uh, I'm gonna try to show you what's happening over there. Um, I don't know if she was in heat like earlier today just for a few hours and she's not wagging as much and he seems interested but not too much so I may I may have missed it. She's a little she's by my leg. Oh there she is. She was wagging. So I don't know. Maybe it means that she's going to go into heat, like standing heat tomorrow. I never like to wait. Like the first sign of heat that I see, it's when I put them together. Like today is really not the best day to do this. So I was hoping that it either happened fast or that, you know, uh, they are they are pretty much the same age. The theme was born on February 22nd and he was born I think March 30th. Pretty sure there's nothing there. I'm pretty sure she is going into heat and that is why she was wagging her tail or it could be that I just missed it. It was like a few hours kind of heat and I just missed it. Uh, but she comes by me and she's like, Grams, this weirdo is, yes, I get it, sweet girl, I get it. It's all right. She has a discharge and she has her vulva kind of swollen and reddish. But other than that, she looks, I mean, you can see she stopped wagging. And so I'm gonna keep an eye on her. It's only gonna get worse the weather. So I may have to do this like little love hotel for her breeding really because the rest of the girls hopefully settle. Although I won't know until October 23rd when all of the girls should go back in their heat cycles if they were not bred. Now, I did see evidence he's eating hay over there, living his best life. 
I've seen evidence of breeding, but that doesn't mean that the girls took. Um, in my experience, they always take unless they short cycle. Briere did short cycle. So, I don't know. I'm just hoping that that's not the case. Or, you know, it won't be a short cycle because it would be a full 18 days on the 23rd for Clara and Gaia. So, if they don't come back into heat, then they will be considered bred. And Athene, she hit the 45 pound mark actually a few days ago. Um, and like I said, she's the right size. She's, I mean, she's ready. But I just need to catch her in her actual standing heat. Just Norma face. I've been doing chores for the last hour and putting things away so the rain wouldn't mess things up and that we just left behind in the open. So, um, but yeah. The only problem I have is that it's easier for me to spot the girls' different behavior so I can kind of see when they're acting different and when their circles, when their cycles are starting. So because of that, sometimes I'm too early, but I rather bring him in and confirm that she's not in sanding heat than just miss this window and then have to wait another 21 days for Athene to come back into heat and make it a little bit uh, further down the year for her kidding. As it is, she'd be kidding if bred sometime soon. She'd be kidding around the mid-March, maybe a little bit further. I just, uh, I'm throwing numbers there. And the other girls are all in the first week of March. I think it's the third, just the first week of March. So it's nice that she, my little sweet girl, will be on a different date, like a different week completely, counting on her due date calculator. But it also, I just don't want to keep pushing it to the point that she's going to have April babies. I wanted to have February babies for all of the girls and at this point none made it. Briere was the only one who was supposed to kid February 25th but she short cycled so I think she's now due on March 1st. So yeah, that's, that's the deal. And these lovers are eating in different spots. They're eating the hay so there's nothing happening here so I'll check back with you guys tomorrow.